citizen, Mr. Mark Perkins. Please come forward and state your name and address for the record, please. Mark Perkins, and I live at 5530 Timberland Circle in Lake Park. And I'm here to uh, try to get some answers in regards to what the current status is of the burn ordinance in Lance County. Uh, I have been given uh, some guidance from the EPD, uh, district manager, to work with the county commissioner to, uh, in regards to certain issues that myself and my family and some of the area residents in, in the area that we live on certain things that we feel are not necessarily uh, vital. So, uh, in, in my thought process, I was like, if there's a way for myself to work with someone about certain aspects, one in particular uh, is a way to uh, monitor, to verify the use of an air curtain disruptor and a pit in the residential areas. Mountain Austin actually has a process that they use uh, that's on their uh, guidelines, and I would like to see at least something along those lines where uh, that process is used. Another is that uh, I, we live in an R1 subdivision, uh, but it's a circle and it goes around a pond, and the people on the pond side of that, their properties are mostly in the water. And then they're condensed, but their property actually extends into the water. And then we've actually had some of our 10 homes built on the exact same circle. Of course, we fall into that uh, area of burning first and third Saturdays of the month. What we would propose is that R1 be added into the uh, dense populated uh, building population for them to only burn the first. Third Saturdays of the month uh, in that aspect. Uh, as a husband of a wife that is, has a hypersensitivity uh, and respiratory issues, uh, as, <clears throat> she is not able to enjoy when certain things go on. And the smell, just the smell of smoke causes issues. Uh, and then the smoke itself is an issue in itself in the, in, in the state of Georgia. So <clears throat> just moving one more aspect away from her having to endure and the, and the residents of our area to endure uh, smoke uh, every day of the week that they can burn because they're, they're allowed to if they want to, uh, where the person calls street can not. So the you know, proposal to move our one into that just to make it a lot more sense. Another thing, I know other counties, not particularly Lowndes County, but I believe Gwinnett County has a process that for, uh, individuals that have a, a respiratory illness, they have a way to submit to the fire marshal, a way to get a, an area that around their residence, whatever size that might be, a circle or a mile or a half mile, whatever that may be, to apply for a, a restriction in birth because of sure you're aware that burning the bleeds is very costly. It can cause problems in, in everyone, but the, the, that particular matter, uh, according to the EPD, it's very costly and can cause illnesses for everyone. Uh, so uh, I, I wasn't quite as prepared. I should have been here two and a half years ago. We moved to Lake Park from North Mount County. Uh, when I retired from the Marine Corps, we moved back. From working in the Lowndes County area. Uh, and now we moved from North Lowndes County to, and never had an issue until we moved to Lake Park. Uh, and another aspect in that, as Lake Park has grown, they're also, they burn any day, whether R10 or whatever. Uh, at least that's the, what I was told uh, from the fire chief some years ago. Uh, it would be, and I'll speak this up quickly. Uh, uh, it would be nice that we could get together with Lake Park and ask that they could move their burning from every day, just like the rest of Lowndes County. I know they're not the unincorporated portion, it's just something, the interaction between the municipalities would be great. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
Thank you, sir. Questions? No questions.